about that. Anyway, welcome back to Shady Moments with Lenlin Queen. Hey guys, it's Lenlin Queen. With today's episode is a controversial topic that needs to be addressed here and now. Fidget spinners! Fidget spinners will be the death of me, and I mean the death. These can be super fun and super annoying. Here's how. If you have a fidget spinner and you're taking a test and you need this to concentrate, I respect that. But if you're just taking using this because it's fun, I also respect that, but try to keep the noise level down. These can actually be super loud when it's really quiet, which is pretty much the same with all things, but these can be super annoying and really loud when you're taking a test. So I advise you to not. Time for reason two. The distraction, the distraction, the distraction. These are so distracting, like, here, let me give you an example. Here, I've got a pen right here. You're trying, to, you're trying to write out your test. Why am I using a book? You're trying to write out your test on a book. You're trying to write out your test on a book, apparently. And Johnny decides, I'm sorry if your name is Johnny, I'm just using it for the video. Johnny decides to play with his blue and gold fidget spinner. Go blue. And it ignores the heck out of you. Not only you, but it ignores everybody in the room. And what's more, it ignores your teacher down the hall because his fidget spinner is so loud. On to the third and final reason, these are annoying and fun. Now this one could go either way. Be careful on this one. This could literally make or break your fidget spinner. Did I say literally? Cause it is. You don't go showcasing your fidget spinner out to every teacher in every class. Some common sense, please. But if you are going to show it, Linda Queen is here to help you pick the right teacher to show it to. Or to mess around with it. But not the point. You have a you gotta have a cool teacher who's tolerable of you. You've got to do it when she's in a good mood. And three, you've got to do it slowly. You can't just sit down, pull your fidget spinner, and start spinning away. No, no, no. Jeez. You have gotta slow down, get situated, get all your homework out, and while she's checking in the homework, pull up the fidget spinner and mess around with it. And then when she starts teaching, put it back. So, and rule. Do not show it to one of those stubborn teachers, or as some YouTubers call it, the French teacher. So that's all I've got today for you lovely, wonderful people. Tomorrow I'm hoping to do a Q&A, a question and answer, for those of you who are new here, which you should probably should know. But leave your questions in the comment section below with hashtag AskLinny. And I will hopefully be asking your, answering your questions tomorrow. So remember, like, comment, good things, and subscribe to my channel because I want to get a hundred or more, hopefully more, subscribers by the summer. And that's only like three or four weeks away. So come on, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe! Anyway, that's all. See ya!